All right, this is Cat, also known as Ghost Cat, stopping at by the uh, Chino gas station, Chino Hill. Uh, just want to clarify what I was saying yesterday. I, I was meeting um, the uh, visual effect guy, <laughs> but the fact is, people cannot afford to drive anymore because of the California politicians. When I say California politician, you know who you are. And uh, after voting in 2018, th there's the gas station. See the prices are like the, that. The cheap price is three dollar eighty nine for the cheapest gas. And uh, the reason why is the politicians rig the ballots so that you're thinking, oh, I gotta vote yes because on this uh, or or whatever on this new taxes. Uh, they don't tell you this is a tax so you get deceived it's a con game that California politician is uh, conjured up with your money and your your suckers I don't care if you're suckers but you get that's why they want low-level intelligence people in uh, residing in California this uh, so the landscape had changed so much. It's not like the Wilson, like the, uh, you know, the old school California that uh, we want to benefit and prosper the people that are loyal to uh, this country, this state, per se. See, I cannot read any of these signs anymore. Um, so the trickery, again, I just, you know, it boggles my mind. I'm not that smart. But on the ballot, where the California politician says that, oh, for sake of clean water, for the sake of roads, for the sake of children's schools, da 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 The bottom line is more bond, more debt, and uh, more taxes. Uh, so, I mean, I dread every time I look at a freaking ballot because I know they use flowery words to make you think that you're doing something good. Uh, on until you really put yourself in such a, put me in such a bondage where uh, every penny is bleeding <laughs> really uh, out of our, our pockets, our veins. So they are not going to be happy until uh, they can own your homes and, uh, you know, possess all your kids and uh, uh, everything. Um, so why am I so angry? Because like I said, now I realize it's all a scam. Uh, people say, oh, it's great. You can put uh, on ballots that the proposition is getting enough signatures and people have a say. No, 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 no. Because maybe we ought to sue them. Carl DeMaio says that there's new tax on the gas. Uh, I guess people just don't know. The state is charging you, taking, taking 12 cents more per gallon uh, than what you're already paying. So I don't know what you're paying, probably 47 cents now if you add together per gallon of tax, state and federal. So when you pay now $4 a gallon of gas, uh, really at least, uh, I would say almost a buck goes to the tax. So then we want to repeal it by signing all this uh, uh, petitions to get the uh, Prop 6, which is to Get rid of the gas tax because nobody can afford to drive. So you know what the uh, Jerry Brown and those evil politicians did? Uh, they first questioned our signatures, the Prop 6, and now, so finally we got verified and they have to put it on the ballot. But guess what? When I open the pages, uh, they use the words like, oh, Prop 6 is going to hurt the roads. Hey, assholes. You use that excuse over and over again by so fleecing us with hundreds of millions of dollars. You just give it to invaders that do not belong to this country. Because they will vote your way. You're just going to uh, like gain more power. So how are we going to win? I really don't know. Uh, and then they spend a gazillion dollars using a poor Asian woman for TV ad says, Oh, Prop 6, I'm going to vote no. I'm sure you saw that ad if you live in California. I'm going to vote no on Prop 6 because it's going to be so bad for the roads. They always say that. It's always like people are going to be dying. You have no fucking roads left until you pay 85 more cents per gallon. So if you get 10 gallons, I mean, you know, I'm literally running on a dry tank. Uh, that's uh, 
that's almost ten dollars worth of a tax for you. All right. Uh, you want to be like this, you should suffer. But these people that voted this way, they said, oh, we can't afford to live here. So they yeah, take off. They, t they pack up their vans, they go to other states. And then when they go to the other states, they leave us behind, pay for this shit, and live in a shithole. And they vote a different way. I mean, they vote the same way uh, when they move to another state. So this got to stop. That's all I'm saying. This got to stop. You guys... Quit being morons and cause me to be in poverty. <laughs>